Sometimes it's easier not to leave your house when you're trying to gather supplies for different needs. It's just the general street hassle outside that you're gonna find. Going after things with the zombies outside is kind of a nightmare. So you less mingling with the zombies and more intermingling and focusing on just relationships that are more important to you is better. I don't like the energy of the zombies to rub off on me. <laughs> I'm gonna just concentrate and get into a state of mind where I start to form a stream of consciousness and any imagery or any words or anything that pops into my head, I'm gonna kind of put it down on the paper. This is a remote viewing session to pinpoint a location within a five mile radius that would be a gold rich region. I'm getting different words here and I'm getting different images. I'm getting pretty much the island of Manhattan so now I'm trying to pinpoint to one area. I'm getting words like trench, line, what I feel is like heavy rocks, large rocks, and then water, sound, sensation. And I'm getting bridge. I really have this sensation when I close my eyes of, of flowing water. I'm zeroing in near where the honey hole will be. A honey hole is a gold-rich area naturally occurring at the bottom of an ancient waterfall or riverbed where the gold is collected near bedrock. Um, this would be Brooklyn here, and this would be the Manhattan area, and this would be the East River. So the areas around Williamsburg are built up using landfill and dirt from other areas. Sometimes it was imported in from other gold-rich areas. So even though Manhattan and Brooklyn may not have been originally gold rich, it's long since been covered up by different gold rich areas. I'm using the pendulum as a way to divine answers for certain things and it can definitely be used to locate lost items or answer simple questions. It seems like I'm getting a response here in this area more as opposed to the other areas. I'm making a green juice. My health is key in getting the highest amount of energy level I can in order to get into the honey hole. This is the best source of nutrition I could find for the work that we're gonna be doing. Oops. This is what you need when you're out on the, in the field, digging. This is your best friend out there. There we go. It even looks like gold. Look at that beautiful, I can see like a streaming green gold color. Hi. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Thank you. This is a rocket as of the Anunnaki request. We're gonna eventually launch the gold that is mined to a drop off point in the atmosphere where it will be picked up then by a spacecraft. The pan for panning. Dowsing rods. Shovel. Ah, oh, waiter's shorts. Hope they fit. prepping to go to my mining location, so I gotta change into the waders. One size 
fits all except for the shoe size. Okay, so this is my dig site. I just want to carve a rune here and starting at the east and working in a clockwise direction. I'm gonna create a field of energy in this area. And finishing back off. I'm getting a really strong activity right around in here. And you can see the things are crossing over actually. So I'm thinking this looks like a natural riverbed here. Ugh. These rocks are pretty slippery. Now what I'm doing here is I'm basically trying to shake any of the heavier substance here down. What will happen is the gold will drop and the lighter stuff will end up floating off the top. And I'm just like, use, there's these ridges built into the pan here. So I'm using these. They'll eventually catch the gold. I'm actually seeing a lot of color in this pan right now. It looks like we might have found the honey hole here. This deposit of sand must have come from a gold rich area and I'm guessing near bedrock just based on the amount of color that I'm seeing in this pan. Can you guys see this? This is beautiful. This is some good gold. Right here is you can see a nugget. Okay so we're on site at the launch site right now and I'm loading the rocket up with the gold that I've collected just as the Anunnaki requested and Rocket is loaded, and I'm getting ready for launch. I'm gonna set the rocket up now, and I'm gonna be launching in T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Both the Lemurians and the Pleiadians have been in contact with me as well as both endorsing this plan as a part of a larger plan made to usurp the global elite and extinguish their agenda for new world order by 2018. Gold plays a pivotal role in this operation. 2018, it's coming, is your responsibility as a member of civilized, this civilization and this earth to get active, get out there, and stop the new world order. We don't want everything controlled. We don't want our monies being destroyed. We don't want any of this stuff. Get the gold, shoot it into space. Nobody can have it. Our currency will remain the same or explode our currency system into oblivion.